Hi everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to Kukulake Japanese channel. I'm Ryo. Today we are making Chinese style bell pepper side dish. It is so simple, super easy to make, and the taste will be super yummy. I said it is Chinese, but the dish is more like Japanese Chinese dish. So it's not 100% Chinese, but it's lovely anyway. So let's get started. All right, the ingredients for Chinese style bell pepper side dish is only two. One is of course bell pepper and the other one is shimeji mushroom. You can switch the mushroom into shiitake or enoki or something like that. You'll be okay. We got three steps making it. Step number one is to cut the root end of shimeji mushroom and divide it into pieces. And shred the bell peppers after you remove the seeds inside. Step number two is to pan fry the shimeji with hot sesame oil. When it's heated, put the cut bell peppers into the pan as well. Step number three is to season it with one teaspoon of sake, half teaspoon of soy sauce, plus half teaspoon of oyster sauce. That's it! Super simple, isn't it? Alright, why don't we go on to step one? Alright, it's time to go to step one. First thing you do in step one is to cut the root end of shimeji mushroom and divide into pieces. Wash the mushroom. Yeah, after you wash the mushroom, prepare the bell pepper stuff. You know, like I did in the uh, Japanese bell pepper side dish video, I'll use thumb to remove the seeds inside. Go like this. Then make a cut, half cut here. Wash it and remove the seeds at the same time. Yeah, now the seeds inside is removed, so I only shred it, but before you shred it, uh, remove the excess water with a paper towel or something like that. But only shred it in pieces. Yeah, now the bell pepper is shredded, so why don't we go on to step two? Alright, why don't we go on to step two? Step two is to pan fry the uh, shimeji mushroom with hot sesame oil. Right, I believe the yeah, pan is heated, so put some sesame oil in and pan fry the shimeji mushroom with medium high heat. It won't take so long before you heat the shimeji mushroom. And when the shimeji is heated, uh, put the hot sesame oil as well. So when you want it so long, when the bell pepper goes soft and brown, time to go to step 3. Alright, I believe the shimeji mushroom and bell pepper just get nice and brown. So, why don't we go on to step 3. Turn the heat into medium and put one tablespoon of sake in. Half tablespoon, no, not tablespoon, half teaspoon of soy sauce. So the sake was one teaspoon plus half teaspoon of oyster sauce. So that's it. Yeah, I guess it's done. Why don't we plate it? Very right, nice time to plate the uh, Chinese style bell pepper side dish. Looks awesome. Yeah, that's it. Now the uh, Chinese style bell pepper side dish is ready to eat. Wow, looks awesome. Alright, now you know to make Chinese style bell pepper side dish. It's super easy. It's super simple, wasn't it? And the taste is super yummy. So why don't you try making it at your home? Anyway, thanks for watching. Please put some comments down below. Put thumbs up button and subscribe. Thanks for watching. And take good care. Arigato. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.